Keel authorities have been dealing with a string of bomb threats against the school district and city buildings. They announced one arrest tonight for a threat against a staff member. But as Local 5's Danielle Zulkowski found out, this investigation is far from over and now involves several branches of law enforcement. A fifth bomb threat against the Keele schools and other city buildings cut the day short when students and staff were evacuated. Police say no explosive devices were found. This threat was made against the elementary, middle, and high schools, as well as the district office, public library, and Keele City Hall. The threat once again referenced the ongoing Title IX investigation about reported incorrect pronoun usage by three eighth grade students. The governor says he has confidence the ongoing investigation will bring those responsible to justice. There's no reason to uh, believe that uh, schools are not a safe place and it's, there's no reason to believe that at the end of the day uh, perpetrators who are causing schools to be closed will be uh, will be brought to trial and, uh, and, and found guilty. The FBI and the Wisconsin Department of Justice have both been notified of this threat and they are helping in the investigation. In Kiel, Danielle Zulkowski, Local 5 News. Thanks, Danielle. No arrests have been made at this time. Now, here are the details about the man who was arrested for allegedly making threats to a staff member at Keele Area School District. According to the FBI, he's 34 years old and from California. He's facing charges in Wisconsin and federal charges in an unrelated investigation. Officials want to stress this arrest is not related to the bomb threats made to the city and the school district.